students welcome to eduyora my name is rinki shah i'm your biology teacher what can you do to prevent from falling yourself sick dear students i have to tell you an interesting story there were two friends ramesh and suresh ramesh was a boy who would wake up early go and exercise bath daily eat healthy breakfast go to school study well come back home complete his homework once a week he will even check on his nails he will cut his nails he will wear clean clothes whereas his friend suresh he was the one who will sleep late wake up late not eat healthy food he will take bath once in 3 days he will not cut his nails always his hair will be shabby they will not be combed properly the clothes which he used to wear may be clean or at time they will be dirty what do you think who is a better person ramesh or suresh whom do you want to be like your answer will be mostly ramesh what exactly was something very interesting about ramesh ramesh used to follow hygiene what is personal hygiene hygiene is a condition and practice that helps to maintain health and prevent us from spreading diseases isn't it very important to prevent disease so the best way to do that is to have personal hygiene in simple terms it means taking care of your own body practice hygiene to prevent from falling ill what are the various ways by which we can have personal hygiene skin care taking regular bath with a mild scented soap keeps our skin from having bad odor and also free from dirt hair you must wash your hair regularly it is essential to remove the dust and grime out of the hair comb your hair daily well dear students one of the word which i just mentioned was grime what do you mean by grime grime means removal of the dirt from your hair third important aspect your hands and nails always wash your hands properly before having a meal keep your nails short and trimmed avoid biting your nails as there is dirt in your nails so when you tend to eat food the dirt tend to enters your mouth through the food you eat next important aspect is teeth and gums you must brush your teeth twice a day in the morning as well as night before going to bed also you need to be careful and take care of your gums so massage your gums as it helps to maintain the overall health of your mouth eyes eyes are the senses which helps us to look at this beautiful world so do take care of your eyes wash your eyes daily with water reading should be done in a good light avoid watching television computer your smartphones for long hours and also in dim light remember to protect your eyes from direct sunlight make use of shades or sunglasses when you go out in sunlight nose clean your nose regularly to remove the mucus cover your nose and mouth while sneezing cover your nose and mouth while sneezing to avoid any kind of droplet infection ear avoid listening to loud music in the ears it's very common nowadays what you observe that people are wearing headphones and with that headphones they listening to loud music all the time that's not good for you students it tends to damage our ear drums which can even lead to hearing issues over a period of time if ear cleaning is necessary make use of ear buds or ear drops or visit an ENT doctor for the ear cleaning in the next module we'll begin with a new chapter till then this is rinki shah signing off thank you very much